we are seeing the uh, greatness of Guruvayur temple. We saw how the idol Guruvayurapan, it's not sculpted by a man. It came directly from Narayana to given to Brahmaji. Brahmaji has given it to Sutapas and Purushni. They did tapas to Brahmaji for a long time to bless uh, them with bhakti. And then a son was born. So Brahmaji gave this Vigraha to Rishi Sutapas and his wife Prishni. So that son was called Prishni Garbha. Bhagavan was born to them. So under Vigraha, Sutapas was later reborn as Kashyapa Prajapati and Aditi Devi. And so then again that idol was passed to Kashyapa Prajapati. And Aditi Mata, they worshipped that Guru Ayurapan. And here in this, for this couple, Bhagavan was born as Vamana. And then again, this Kashyapar passed it on to Vasudeva, the father of Krishna. Vasudeva and Devaki got this Vigraha. And they were doing puja to them. After that, Vasudeva gave it to Bhagavan Krishna himself. And Bhagavan was worshipping this deity in Dwaraka. At the end, when Bhagavan descended, uh, ascended back to Vaikuntha Loka, Bhagavan told Uddhava, his favorite Bhagavata Bhakta, Bhagavan said, Uddhava, this idol will come floating in the sea, when Varaka will be submerged in the sea, but this idol will be saved, it will come floating. At that time, you take this Vigraha and go to your Guru Brahaspati and get it installed in a suitable place. So Uddhava receives this idol, and with Guru Brihaspati, uh, they, Guru Brihaspati goes all over the world where to install this idol. And Guru Brihaspati and Vayu Bhagavan, Vayu Devata together, they, Vayu Bhagavan has to, you know, uh, hold the Vayu and come here. And then they search all over the world and then they come to this spot in Kerala where Lord Shiva is also there. There is a Mamiur Appan Shivango will there and there Lord Shiva points out this place and there it was installed. This Guruvayu Appan Kovil is years old. It has survived so many Mughal empire, uh, emperors came and tried to ransack the temple and steal the deity. Nothing could happen. Guruvayu Appan was saved by the priests. Even today the Nambudri family is born, uh, only the people born in that lineage can do the Puja for Guru Ayurapan. In every pure, pure uh, Namudris who observe strict ritual, tantric worship uh, with uh, as per the Shastra, they do. They will not take a drop of water till 2 p.m. From morning to 2 p.m. they observe the Snanam and all the uh, ritual properly and uh, worship the Guru Ayurapan. In that Guru Ayurapan uh, temple, our Narayana Bhattadri wrote Narayaniyam. By narrating Narayaniam there, the temple became famous. Until then, the temple was not well known. But since Narayaniam was composed, Bhattaradari made the temple famous. For us to learn about Guru Ayurapan, we needed a Bhattadari. A Bhattadari only brought the greatness of Guru Ayurapan by writing Narayaniam. Like how Valmiki Maharishi gave us Ramayanam. Without Ramayanam, we would not understand the dear Lord Rama or Mother Sita or the beautiful sacrifice and the story. Come, somebody comes and gives the story to us, right? That Rishi Valmiki. For Bhagavadam, it is Vyasa Rishi. Vyasa. Adhimadri Narayanetika Bhattadri. Anala, we say, Bhattapanam Anisham Pridibhavayami. I bow down to the Narayana Bhattadri. May he bless me. We are saying, uh, Narayana Shloka. So, let us begin the first chapter of Narayaniam. I hope everybody has book. Hmm? Shri Krishna Yavara Brahmane Namaha I will, I had already posted the script again after class. We will post all the Dhyana Shloka again. Okay. Dhyana Shloka script and audio are already posted before. But since new people have joined, they may not have seen it. So, I will post again later. Any, any other question? Shri Krishna Yavara Brahmane Namaha Sandra Nanda Vamodha Magamanu 
సగుణ బ్రహ్మం గురువాయురు ద సేమ్ నిర్గుణ బ్రహ్మన్ ఈస్ ద వన్ దట్ హస్ టేకెన్ ఎ రూపం అండ్ స్టాండింగ్ టు కుట్టి గురువాయురు పని స్టాండింగ్ ఇన్ గురువాయూర్ సో దిస్ నిర్గుణ బ్రహ్మన్ విచ్ ఈస్ అనుపమితం కంపేర్ ఉపమా ఉపమాన కంపేర్ కుడుకో ఒన్ను మిలే దేర్ నథింగ్ టు కంపేర్ విత్ అనుపమితం కాల దేశావది బ్యా నిర్ముక్తం కాల దేశ ఇట్ విల్ బి నాట్ కన్ఫైన్ టు వన్ కాలం ఇట్ ఈస్ ఎవర్ ప్రెసెంట్ ఇన్ ద పాస్ట్ ఇన్ ద ప్రెసెంట్ అండ్ ఫ్యూచర్ ఇట్ ఈస్ ఆల్వేస్ దేర్ ఇట్ వాస్ ఆల్వేస్ దేర్ బిఫోర్ మీ ఇట్ వాస్ దేర్ నౌ ఐమ్ హియర్ ఇట్ ఈస్ దేర్ ఆఫ్టర్ మీ ఆల్సో ఇట్ విల్ బి దేర్ before this universe started brahman was there the universe is manifested it is there when the universe has been dissolved it will be there that brahman kala desha everywhere it's there it's not just in chennai or just mumbai it's everywhere that's like the sky is all pervading same sky in atlanta same sky in houston texas same sky in bombay that brahman all pervading ore vastu only one one sky the most of the time it will be compared to the sky the sky is everywhere there is only one sky pervading the whole universe the sky you cannot see is it a form can you can i touch the sky can i pierce the sky i couldn't it's so it can it cannot be reached but it is there covering like an umbrella adam bhagwan so when they give atma uh, a comparison for atma they will say sky mostly but it's close even beyond the sky there is alakam there is the re- region of you know guruvayurappan high over there so you can imagine is something which is beyond time and space so our time is only 50 years or 80 years or something but guruvayurappan time always there eternal he knows my countless previous births he knows my what where i am going next he only planned it so he knows you from many years um, janma before he knows you from in, in and not only you you are children and your parents and your husband everyone he knows so he knows everything that is called gnanam that is bhagavan satyam eppome irka gnanam ella theriyum he knows everything about everyone he does not have to be in one you know this place to solve a problem he can solve a problem from up there when draupadi is calling krishna as dushasana is disrobing her krishna was not there physically but he just showed a hand and the sari kept pouring that is brahman there is no physical necessity for him because he is everywhere he is here in the space he is here he is in the picture he is here he is in the world yes he is in the world he is in the book he is in the book everywhere there is only bhagavan kala desha va divya nirmuktam he is not limited to time or space if i am in, in this room i am not in the kitchen right if i am here in 8:30 i will not be here after 10:30 right i will be in the bedroom like that we have time and space limit bhagavan is everywhere at all times that is guru vairapan characteristic this is the saguna upad uh, nirguna upasana or nirguna brahman saguna brahman chendu idan and the vigraham also idan brahman also that is what is going to establish kala desha vadivya nirmuktam nitya muktam nitya muktam eppome eternally free you and i are bound by the maya of bhagavan we do not have freedom we are bound by certain uh, rules and certain duties and responsibility we are not able to just get away like that we are bound as to a, 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 the owner of the dog will be holding the dog in a leash however it only have little space to wander around but he'll be still holding right we only have little space to go in our in the territory but we are not really free there is like an invisible leash pulling us which we don't see but we are all bound by that every one of us like the leash of time is there a leash is binding us and it's invisible adhimari we are all bound by the rope of bhagavan he is our master 
So we are bound, but Bhagavan is eternally free. Only the one who is free can free us. The one who is already bound, they cannot free us. So if you want freedom, you go to Guru Ayurveda. Only he can release. Only he can release us from the bondage. So we go to Guru Ayurveda. Only, only he can release us. That Bhagavan who is free from the bondage of Maya. He controls the Maya. Maya will do her, um, do her thing in the world. Maya is playing the game because Guru Ayurveda is controlling her. So, everything happened because Guru Arpan decided it to be like that. So, Maya is putting the jal, Maya jal. Right? So, we cannot tell Maya, hey, please release me. No, please, I'm sorry. Can you be easy on me? Amma, I have not listened. You have to go to Guru Arpan. <laughs> then, if he is pleased with you, he will say, Maya, okay, let go. Ye mera hai. He's, she is mine, don't bother her. Then, Maya will release the whole. You cannot go to Maya and plead and all. She will not care. Only Guru Arpan will care. So, we are bound by the Maya of Bhagavan, which Maya, Bhagavan is controlling it. He is the master of the Maya and he is free. Right? But you and I are in the Maya and we are bound. So, Nitya Muktam is Guru Arpan. Sandhananda Satchit Ananda. Epome Ananda Tilaka. Right? No tension at all. Any enemies are coming and attacking our Krishna just now. Uh, twiddles a, a thumb and then he, they are destroyed. He just like kicks them with the feet and they are destroyed. Right? He just, with a glance he can destroy people. He is, he is but he gets no tension at all. Only when the Bhakta is in trouble, Bhagavan gets little tension. He, he, he cries when Kuchela came. Sudama, when he comes, Kuchela, why did you delay? He will ask. He cries for Bhakta. But otherwise, Krishna, nothing affect him is always in a state of Atma Ananda. Ananda If you want to be happy, what make Krishna happy. Our Guruji says. If you want to be happy, make Krishna happy. That's the way to get happiness. Right? So because he is the embodiment of happiness. He is the embodiment of knowledge. He is the embodiment of existence. That Bhagavan who is also without the limitation of Kala Desha. No time and space, that Bhagavan who is eternally free from the bondage of Maya, Nigama Shada Sahasrena, all the Upanishad, Nigama, all the Vedas and Upanishad try to explain this Bhagavan. Only by Vedanta, we cannot finish explaining Bhagavan. Then they wrote, Ravyasa Vyasa Rishi wrote, Mahavaradam, 100,000 shlokas to describe Bhagavan, still didn't finish, still couldn't complete. Then he said, no more is there, no, okay, now let me write uh, Brahma Sutras. There also he couldn't completely finish telling the glory of Bhagavan. Then he wrote Srimad Bhagavadam to tell. So, Bhagavan's gunas, they never end, they're infinite. Nigamakashada Sahasrayana, hundreds of texts try to reveal the nature of this Brahman, but still they fall short. They are not able to complete Telling us about Bhagavan because he is still beyond that. Even though many people told Guru Arpan's story, still it is left. Still more people will say, still uh, it will not finish. How many times we tell Narayanim, still it will not get boring. Because it has the existence easily. You can feel existence, Jnana and Ananda in the Narayanim itself. Because it will never get boring. If you read any comic books, they'll get stressing, stressful and you'll say, enough. if you watch TV, you get tired of the movie where you have to put so much brain to understand the suspense and all. It gets tensed up. Here, Anandam. Idhida Krishna Kata, Anandam. Kata Amritam. Idha Amritam, we are drinking nectar. And so when we drink nectar, of course our life will increase, right? Our bliss will increase. The quality of time will, will become better. That's Bhagavan. That's Narayanim. So, even after Nigama Shada Sahasrena Nirbhasya Manam Aspashtam Terilai. Still Puriya Lai. Then, how to get? Trishta Matre. Then, you have to understand the Atma. Atma, you have to try. You have to 
ಬೃಹದಾರಣ್ಯಕ್ಕೆ ಉಪನಿಷತ್ ಸ್ಥಳಿ ಆತ್ಮವ ಅರೆ ದ್ರಷ್ಟವ್ಯ ಶ್ರೋತವ್ಯ ಮಂತವ್ಯ ನಿಧಿಧ್ಯಾಸಿತವ್ಯ ಯು ಹ್ ಟು ಸ್ಪೆಂಡ್ ಟೈಮ್ ಟು ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಅಂಡ್ ನೋ ಪುಟ್ ಲಿಟಲ್ ಎಫರ್ಟ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ ದಟ್ ಟೆಲ್ಲಿಂಗ್ ಆಲ್ವೇಸ್ ಗುರುವಾರ್ಪನ್ ಗುರುವಾರ್ಪನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಗುರುವಾರ್ಪನ್ ಟು ಕೈಂಡ್ ಆಫ್ ಥಿಂಕ್ ಆಫ್ಟರ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ ಯು ನೋ ದೆನ್ ಯು ಹವ್ ಟು ಸೇ acha maybe how she likes it so much maybe there is something in it like that you will think then you will say how that mommy chanting so well i also want to chant like that you will see somebody else having the rest then you say i also want to so the sangam is important this is called a sat sangam where we get here sat katha of krishna katha there is only krishna katha there is only krishna kirtan there is only nama sankirtanam that is sat sang so this this has to be think thought about and we have to realize anubhavatla varanam you have to have anubhavam not just reading like a parrot okay i am brahman i am brahman you keep on saying it's not going to come but to kind of start feeling feeling that feeling right it not just merely putting a tilaka or the waving lamps and say i am hindu you have to feel it right feeling anubhavam then you will realize is and the guruvarpan over there is also here therefore i am not separate from him he, he and i am same he and i are one wow then why did i get tense for about everything you will get the realization until then we have to come to satsang and hear and try a little bit and we should get the longing krishna see i also want to know krishna so many bhakta you have saved no can you also give me a chance like that when you start asking krishna gives more chance so and the guru arpan in the picture over there is also inside me then when you feel that feeling anandam nanedan anandam there's nothing to cry no tension i'm not weak i'm always strong i'm always here i never go anywhere i'm here am i here are you here you are here i am here you will say i am here satyam sat nanda sat chit and ekteriya the i feel it i feel the chat chit that's called conscious arke consciousness arke i pakare ne i am seeing you i am seeing me i am speaking i am watching i am here right so when you do that again and again you feel the anandam that is called drishta matre so we have to realize that atma within us we to hear about it shrotavya you are hearing about it mantavya then you kind of reflect upon it one more time when you go and stand the chant the shloka try to just remember the meaning once more and then say ha ba then say ah can i go to gurwai and now let's go to gurwai no next time when we go to india you will do that then you will try to see bhagavan over there then he will he will do magic on you then kuch bhi hoga there is nothing telling what he guru arpan will do with you everybody it does different games so like that he will give a smile that's it one pull it will be done your will be done <laughs> like that so don't know guru arpan okay so shrotavya mantavya nidhi dhyasitavya again and again contemplate atra guru arpan ke time gurkan that is how the atma is that is the bhagavan you need to spend at least in your mind you don't physically sit down and drop everything and do this it's not a doing but slowly let it come let it come and then not forcefully it is not a ego work ego ka work illa inga intellect ka work kam illa it is not about the senses or the buddhi cannot tell good us about guru arpan we read so many books with buddhi okay so many subjects we have studied in college or school etc we don't keep everything we pass the exams and some things we just give give back but some things i in felt and feeling is there for only those we take with us always what we feel so always about feeling is more powerful than uh, buddhi the feeling right at the heart level the heart other than consciousness or the, the feeling when the and the uh, feeling will only accelerate our progress to bhagavan 
So the feeling has to come when you hear katha from, uh, you know, uh, from outside like that, not YouTube wala. But a person is telling, right? Who loves Narayanam and is telling, then you, you also start loving, right? A person has love, they pass the love, right? A bhakta will pass bhakti. You can't get by from a store. Bhakti, how you get means from another bhakta you get. Like that, this atma, you have to hear about it. Think about it. Contemplate about it. Aspashtam drishta matre punaha. Uh, after you do this for some time, then you say, Uru purusha atmakam, Brahma tattvam. This Brahma tattvam, Tatta avadbhadi saksha. Are you in here again? Bhagavarpan is right here only. Why did I worry so much that Bhagavan is right here? In Guruvayur, it's telling, Tatta avadbhadi saksha archa avadara murti has come. This itself is an avatar for our sake. Bhagavan has taken. Why he has to take so much trouble to pass on the murti from Narayana to Brahma to Suttapas to Kashyapar to uh, Vasudeva to here, Krishna here and still Guru Ayur, right? Why Bhagavan is doing it, right? For our sake. He has descended from so much time. He has come so many yugas before those avatars happened, those uh, People were there, Suttapas Rishi or Kashyapa Prajapati or Vasudeva, millions, already so many years over. The Vigraha still remains, right? It has been passed on. So it is an, another avataram. Avatara means descending down, coming down, coming down from a high place, coming to down for our sake to bless us. That Guruvayrapan is Sakshat in Guruvayur. Saksha Guru Pavana Puri and the Bhagyam Janana. We are blessed to see this Bhagavan. Bhagyam, Bhagyam. Narayanim is Maha Bhagyam. Parama Bhagyam, Narayanim, Mukkaidi. Wow. Awesome. There's nothing else. Hundred cantos. This, this, for me, this, I already told you this life breath. Narayanim. So, that we are Bhagyavan. We get Narayan in, Narayan in our hand, we have Bhagyam. So only one shloka, right? Now see. That is first shloka, we have to get the foundation. Now you will see the uh, more supporting facts for the, those things. The Brahma Swarubham is Guruvayapan in Guruvayur. Allah Brahman. That is established. It is beyond the time space. It's, it's eternally free. It is incomparable. There is nothing else like it. Right? And the Brahman is Durlabham. So, next loka. Evam Durlabhya Vastunya Pisulabhataya Hastalabdhe Yadanyade Tanva Vacha Diyava Bhajadi Badachanaha Shudra Taivas Pudeyam Yede Tavas Vayam Tu Sthirata Manasa Vishwa Pida Pahatyai Nisheshatmana Menam Guru Pavana Puradi Shameva Ashrayama Nice, every shloka is like honey. You cannot imagine, you know, I cannot stop. Evam Durlabhya Vastunya Pisulabhataya Astalabdheya Danyate Tanva Vacha Dhyava Bhajadi Bata Janaha Shudra Taivas Puteyam Yede Tavas Vayam Tu Sthira Tara Manasa Vishwa Pida Pahatyai Nisheshatmana Menam Guru Pavana Puradisha Meva Ashrayama Sulabha Vastu We are getting Sulabham We are getting easily Evam Gurulabhya Vastu Nyapi Sulabha Taya so easily we are getting by Narayanam class, wherever you are sitting in your homes, far away by technology we are connecting and you are hearing, right? Hearing is first. To hear about Guru Arpan is the first. Navavida Bhaktila Shravanam first. Shravanam Kirtanam Vishnu Smaranam Padasevanam Archanam Vandanam Dasyam Sakyam Atmani Vedanam the nine types of Bhakti, right? And the Shravanam is first for us, right? Hearing. So, this vastu is to be heard about. Then, only we, first guna and then the rupa. Guna ka 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 ka, 
Apara Rupa we are getting. So, Rukmini Devi says same thing. Krishna, I heard your gunas. Then, I heard about your Rupa. I have not seen you yet. I have not seen Guru Harpan yet. But I heard the gunas. See, the gunas are come. Then, next is Darshan will come. So, the gunas are amazing to hear. This Durlabham to get is not easy. Now we got Sulabham because Guru Harpan loves. So, somewhere and all he brought people together. And to hear Narayaniyam, this we got in our palm of our hand. Hatta Labde. We got easily in the palm of our hand. Yad Anyade. Tanva Vacha Dhyava. Yet, we are using our body to run after daily things, mundane things, wasting like every day. It's very sad. When people do that, it is Chudra Daiva Sputayam. It is a pitiable condition. So, the author, but does he feel sorry for such people? Even after getting this, you are not listening now. Very sad. Okay, anyway, your time will come sometime like this. When Bhaktas feel sad, when somebody doesn't come to satsang, I feel very bad. I'm passionate. I, I want, I mean, please come now. See what treasure we have here. Please come now. Can you say Nama? Can we come to your house and do Nama? We do that. Why? Because we love, we want to give. The rest we feel, we want to give. Did I ask peace? No. Nobody asked peace. We just want to give and give feeling because we feel let like that person also enjoy, no? I'm enjoying myself, that everyone enjoy. Like that we want to give, right? This is a different thing from the worldly thing. If the world will compare, you cannot compare. So, this author feels the same way. Why people don't come? Then he says, E te tavat vayam tu, but we are all bhakta. We are not going to stop. We will only come and be sthiratara manasa. Uh, see, sthiratara manasa. Manasa sthirama vekkanam. No matter what, I am going to complete Narayana Kla. What come what may. Like that a resolve is needed. A firm resolve is needed first. Then once you do that, then Guru Arpan removes all the obstacles. Right? First we have to have the intent. Then Bhagavan will fulfill that. Okay? Any dharmic intent, Bhagavan will fulfill. So, Sthira Tara Manasa Bhattadri himself is telling, I am going to write your glories. First day only it is, right? Thiratara Manasa, why? Vishwa Pida Pahatyai. They were all going through endless suffering. Vishwa Pida, everybody is suffering. Some, every, everybody is going through something or another. Right? So, we don't have time to solve each one's problems. Because, you know, by the time I understand, and I do not have the capacity to solve another's problem. I am only already drowning in my problems. Where will I solve another problem? Right? Who can solve a problem? Only Guru Arpan. Therefore, Narayanam, hold on to Bhagavan. That will slowly give answers and it will give you strength to endure. And here you will say like that. It will give you strength to endure everything. So, that is why Vishwa Peda Apahatya Idikam Bhagavan Da We need Bhagavan for this also. This Bhagavan, Nishayashatmana Venam Itatma Patma. Namatma Kuratma, he is our closest friend, he is our supreme well wisher. Our Facebook friends cannot do much. Right? They'll say power mile, you know, that's all. They'll console us. But who is going to really protect us? Who is our true well wisher? Guru Arapan. When you are doing well, he is happy for us. Truly happy for us. That is Bhagavan. So he is Nishya Shatmana Menam Gurupavana Puradi Shameva. I will, uh, I, I will only surrender to Guru Ayurapan alone. Anya ashray chod I do not want other ashraya. I only ask, take ashraya in Guru Ayurapan. If he want, he let him solve my problem. Otherwise, I am good. That is the stand. Bhattadri, he did not go to doctor. No doctor could fix it. He had to come to Guru Ayurapan. Nobody can fix the problem. He is not able to walk. Nobody can say, hey, take my leg, you can walk. Anybody can give that? No. Right? Some problems only Guru Arapan can solve. No matter who stands upside down with money or uh, network or contact or whatever, sometimes some problem nobody can solve. Only Guru Arapan. It's satyam. So, 
அதனால குருவா குரு பவன பூராதீசமே ஆசிரியாமகிபுல்ஸ்லோகாஸ்ட்வாசிவாக்கியம்ச்சாதிரமந்த ீரிஷ ஷூயதேசவாக்கியாதிஸ்ட்ரெஸ்ட்ரைட் ஸ்வீகா பட் குருவாயூரப்பன் பாடி சுத்த சத்வா சத்வ குணாக்கு மேலொரு சுத்த சத்வா அஸ்பெக்ட் இஸ் தேர் தேர் இஸ் அப்சல்யூட்லி நோ டெய்ட் ஆஃப் ரஜஸ் ஆர் தமஸ் ஐ வில் எக்ஸ்பிளைன் திஸ் குணாஸ் அனதர் கிளாஸ் ஓகே சோ திஸ் பியூர் ஃபார்ம் த பகவான்ஸ் ஃபார்ம் இஸ் சோ பியூர் தட்ஸ் வை இட் ரிஃப்ளெக்ட்ஸ் தட் ஆனந்த ஆல்வேஸ் த வாட் இஸ் த மைண்ட் வில் பி ஆல்வேஸ் சோ ரிஃப்ளெக்டட் இன் த பாடி கைண்ட் ஆஃப் ரைட் the gunas of a person will appear outside also the, sometimes the eyes have a shine for some people because they have uh, they have done lot of sadhana and uh, very pure eye ka aval ko light rakum brahmajnani so the eyes will or shine rakum ava they also have a human sharira but their eyes will have a shine thus become pure the body when they have attained the brahman the body even though it looks like two hands and two feet but there is a purity in that body jeevan mukta sharira like the saints of maharashtra tukaram or janeshwar maharaj or you will see yogi ram surat kumar or shri shri anna our sharira is or tej tej right like that bhagavan sarupam is shuddha sattva swarupa aparikalana to it's not having taint of rajas or tamas right that bhagavan it is also bhuda irbhuda indriya is the bapu of bhagavan even though looks like chaturbhuja rupa with panchabhuta tala ulla shariram alla our body is made of the panchabhuta akasha vayu jalam prithvi uh, etc right agni and all that is our body but bhagavan body is not that panchabhuta it is the chinmaya shariram every pore of bhagavan is chinmaya at is the sat shuddha sattva sharira of bhagavan shuyate vyasa vakyam vyasa is describing the rupa of bhagavan this this sharira tat sat chatvat yanacha dita para sukha chit garbha nirbhasa roop that's why is revealing that ananda uh, state so it is catching the, you also get the ananda when you stand in front of the vigraha it is you no know, sending rays of uh, ananda like the sun is sending its rays like that the sharira is emitting rays of bliss so when you go there you catch it that is the vigraha of bhagavan it is yadachadida parasuka chidgarbha nirbhasa roopam in the roopathile tasmin dhanyara mande the fortunate one will read this and think about this dhanyara mande shruti madhi madhure it is sweet to hear and talk about shruti madhi madhure it is sweet to hear about and think about 
अति दुर्गल्प रूपम सुग्रहे विग्रहे ते वेदांता बुक कला व्हेन वी रीड इन माय फीलिंग विल नॉट कम द डिवोशनल टेक्स्ट विल रिवी गिव भक्ति लाइक द डिवोशनल हिम नारायणीयम एंड भागवतम दे गिव दे आर लाइक द सीड ऑफ वेदा और इज द सीड भागवतम इज द जूस द सीड வந்து ट्री आचे ट्री ले வந்து फ्रूट வந்து फ्रूट ले द जूस एट द जूस इज भागवतम அது மாதிரி அந்த ஜூஸ் இஸ் நாராயணியம் so when we read we are drinking the juice right so that is why bhaktas can sugrahe vigrahe te they can relate and they can understand because they have, you know you have had eaten jalebi they are able to understand sweetness right then they can understand the sweetness of this form the purity of this form that is pure bhagavan then another shloka nishkampe nitya purne निरवधि परमानंदपीयूषरूपेलोलोलासुल्यूमस्तात्मा
चतुर्भुज शंक गुदायुध श्रीवत्सलक्ष्मल शोभि कौस्तुभम पीताबर सांद्र भगवान स्वयं Krishna Avadaram Narayana is 50% of Narayana. Srimad Bhagavad Gita, 10th Skandam is full Krishna Chattam, 90 chapters. So, Bhagavad Gita is about for Krishna. Why Krishna? Vyasa himself is an avatar of Narayana. Vyasa, Krishna Dvaipayana, Vyasa wrote, Vyasa wrote Bhagavad Gita Manala, by Krishna, of Krishna, for Krishna. That is Bhagavad Gita. So, that Bhagavan is Shruti Madhi Madhure Sugrahe Vigrahe Tre Nishkambe Nitya Purne The Kallolo Lasa Tulyam Like the wave coming from the ocean Bhagavan is Purna Bhakta Shuddha Sattva Swarubam Kaluvimala Dharam Sattvam Ahustada Atma Kasmano Nishkana Swam Takalai Diva Chaha Swakala Sveva Bhuman Aha